If you don't have access to electricity, you don't have access to refrigeration. And if you don't have access to refrigeration, you're constantly trying to procure food because food doesn't last. For example, in Africa, 40% of all food that's grown goes to waste before anyone can eat it. My co-founder, Kwong Trong, came into contact with something called a Zero-Pot Cooler, invented by a Nigerian school teacher in the 1980s. It seems like this could solve so many problems worldwide, but it's heavy, it's breakable, you can't really mass produce it. Can we make it lighter, more efficient, and ultimately have it be less expensive through mass production? That's what we've done. We've essentially created a fabric that mimics human skin. It's called Zyrtec. It allows water to transpirate, and it draws heat out of the unit, and that's how we get our cooling effect. For example, tomatoes in the open air might last for a few days, and one of our containers can last 20 days. If we can have a real impact on the overall income of a poor rural Moroccan farmer, and we can multiply that over roughly the 719 million people who live in climatically appropriate areas who have no access to electricity, we can really change the way they eat and the way they live. When Kwong approached me with this idea, I thought that this was the most impactful thing I could imagine doing with my life. We can just help hundreds of millions of people to live better lives. If that's what it says on my gravestone, I'll be a happy man.